Revenant wall strafe step by step. You're first going to launch into a normal wall bounce. After you do that, you're going to start holding your D key. Once you start holding your D key, you're never letting go of it for this entire trick. Once you start holding your D key, you're going to scroll wheel forward for forward input movements as you look left. This with your D key is going to swing you into the wall. Once you grab the wall, you're going to continue holding D and go into a wall run. Once you get to the edge of the wall, you need to do the same movement. So you're still holding D, but you space bar, jump off the wall, and then you begin scrolling while looking left to swing back into it on the other side, and then continue wall running. At this point, we're starting to lose momentum. See how we're starting to fall down? So we need to extend the last bit of our wall run to get to the edge of this wall. So we're going to jump off, and if you notice when I do that, I look a little bit outwards. This is to create some distance between you and the wall because there's a minimum amount of time that you have to spend off the wall before you can reattach. So you jump, look out a little bit, same motion to swing back in, and then once you touch the edge of the wall, you do the same thing as we've been doing this whole time. Scroll wheel, look in, still holding D, back into a wall run, but this time we actually have a bunch of momentum created and we can keep flying. 